the team using the worst units from each rarity? Could I actually win? And more importantly, which rarity would actually have the worst cards? Either way, before we get into anything else, let's start with the common cards. So with this team, there's only two and no farm unit. So I know what you're thinking, which one's worse? And after a little bit of experimentation, I found out that the camera woman is a lot worse. Mainly because her cooldown starts with three seconds. Uh, All right, so I assume with this, our best strategy is to just upgrade this one camera woman, camera woman as fast as possible. Because that cooldown being three seconds is not gonna cut it. Okay, I got her all the way maxed out. Her radius is 12, but she's not able to reach this track. That's all I get. This little strip. The camera woman might be beautiful, but she is not a good toilet killer. I've essentially optimized the camera woman's placements by putting them all on the corner. So far, wave six, she's been able to do the trick just fine, but... It hasn't been that smooth. We're gonna walk on to Camel Woman Avenue. All right, now I have all my max units placed out, so what I have can literally not get any stronger than this. So far in easy mode, in case you guys literally don't play it anymore, you only really get a mix of spider toilets and police toilets and small toilets. I haven't really seen any other toilets. We got a couple of assassin toilets now, but... The Camera Woman Avenue has it under control. All right, on wave 18, we're going to turn off auto skip so I don't accidentally start wave 20 and have the big boss come before I'm prepared for it. And we're going to take care of the large toilet, please. Okay, good. Nothing's gotten past this row of Camera Woman yet. They test my might with two glasses toilet before giving me the boss. Bring them on. All right, the 38,500 HP boss toilet just spawned. Is our worst team of common units going to be good enough to take care of him? Okay, so it looks like passing this corner, we're going to do a whopping... Oh, no. We only did like 10,000 damage to him so far. All right, I have to sell all my camera woman here and then place him all over here. Okay, that strip of camera woman over there did a pretty good chunk of his HP as well. I'm going to go run over there and sell all of them and do it again. All right, he's made it to this strip as I'm like selling everything over there. Hopefully this strip is just enough though, so I don't have to stress out anymore. I think I'm just going to get it. I think I'm barely going to get it and see you later, boss toilet. All right, so we have commons up next, but which uh, uncommon is statistically the worst? It's not the large heart. It's definitely not the lucky, but it's between the summon units. It's the cameraman or the car speaker man. And yes, it's it's the cameraman. He's worse. Uh, bah! Since common units can beat easy mode, we have to see if uncommon units can beat medium mode. This really isn't fair for you, cameraman. I'm so sorry. Starting with only $200 on medium mode 2 is not going to be doing anyone any favors. I'm already leaking Ooh. toilets. The hardest part of this challenge is that you barely make any money to actually make your unit stronger. And so as you can see behind me, there is just hundreds of toilets coming out of the conveyor belt. I'm struggling to get a level 1 cameraman. To level two. Somehow, so away, we only just now took our first bit of leak damage. Well, that's not looking too good. And to no one's surprise, the worst uncommon unit can't solo medium mode all on its own. So what's next, you might ask? That's a great question. We're just going to move up in rarities. We're going to upgrade our unit to now use the worst rare unit. And statistically, the worst rare unit is actually the TV man. Some people would say it's a speaker helicopter, but I promise you that 10 range difference means everything. The speaker helicopter is actually super viable relatively speaking as well this is our first farm unit that we could get our hands on and it is technically the worst farm unit so we're gonna use it uh, but i'm really hoping things will be different this time mainly because i have a farm unit but the tv man still sucks not only is the tv man not great i'm only getting an extra 50 bucks from the rose farm right away ouch it also doesn't help the tv man's range is the size of a peanut I had to place the TV man back here just to avoid myself from dying. Our first real challenger approaches the dual claw. And yeah, it proved to be a challenge and immediately put my TV man to sleep. Dude, these dual claws are my TV man's bane. Yeah, imagine my TV men are Superman and the dual claws are kryptonite. That's exactly how this feels. Oh no, we're getting parasites and minigun toilets now. I gotta turn off auto skip. I didn't even realize I still had it on. Oh no. Even with the TV man and the speaker rose farm, the worst rare unit cannot solo medium mode. It did get pretty close though. So once again, what do we do? How do we move on from here? Well, obviously the worst rare unit couldn't be medium mode. So now you have to use the worst epic unit, which is my beloved, the surveillance camera woman. 
I don't think you're that bad. Don't listen to them. And since it's the worst rarity of the farm units, I also get to use the pumpkin farmer. Ah, uh, bad! Fun fact about me, I think the pumpkin farmer is the coolest looking farm unit. One really good thing about the surveillance camera woman is her range is insane though. Some people would debate that she's technically not the worst epic unit. However, from a da like damage per second standpoint, she is and her range is double that of just the normal epic cameraman. However, I went in favor of the surveillance camera woman. Not because she's a woman. Why would you think that? Surveillance camera overload. The camera woman are taking taking care of medium mode so far. The dual claws have not been a problem for them. They're able to kill everything before they even get close to them. Yeah, maybe this epic unit is too epic for medium mode. I might have gotten a little too cocky. I might have gotten a little too cocky. Okay, I had to turn off auto skip for a little bit. Some of the toilets got deep on the track, but we're hanging on. All right, I'm having to start selling pumpkin farmers to make space for more surveillance women. The surveillance woman can't do enough. They'll, they'll be able to kill that vacuum toilet. I'm sure of it. Every woman of surveillance I have has been placed down. So this is the strongest we are going to get. We're effectively doing 750 times 15 DPS right now. What is that? Hey, Siri. Hey, hey. Si <clears throat> we're basically doing 11,250 damage per second. We're effectively as strong as one singular large firework cameraman right now. That's not great. I don't think I need to be the one to say this. Even with the worst epic unit on media mode, we are not even close to dominating these toilets. This is very intimidating for all of these medium mode units. The single attack units just aren't that great. Well, this isn't good. This mutant toilet is about to make it behind my defenses. I've had auto skip off too. In short, the epic unit might just not be strong enough. The only thing that might save her is her range. Look at how slow we're doing 38,000 damage per second. Never back down, never what? Never back down, never what? All right, can these three surveillance camera women fight this boss to it you know i don't think they need to they might actually kill it but i think we can tank that out anyways we don't need to find out the surveillance woman clutched up 92,000 hp vacuum toilet coming in uh the vacuum toilet just disintegrated half my surveillance women where'd they where'd they go they're just they're just gone oh they're back now i didn't know the vacuum still did that that's awesome man they make me work hard to literally not die oh you have to take out the first one you have to at least take out that first one who how much damage are you gonna do oh there's just no way would you guys have guessed through this point in time that not even the worst epic unit could not beat medium mode i find that so hard to believe well now we have to try the worst legendary unit a lot of people make the case that this unit shouldn't even be a legendary unit and i also agree it's not the spear speaker man it's definitely not the cubit bow woman it's not the speaker large tv man it's the ninja when did he even sneak his way on here and unfortunately for us there are zero legendary farm units so let's see if the ninja can solo nightmare mode by himself uh, but surely surely a legendary unit can solo medium mode all on his own right it's actually kind of sad for the ninja cameraman he used to be one of my favorite units in the game that just shows how much times have changed in case you're wondering it's smarter to just upgrade this one unit first than placing down multiples of them getting that early cooldown speed is actually what matters more than anything else especially because we're not really making money you can't afford to leak any toilets behind because you can't place units to kill them one fully maxed out ninja camera boy coming right up good news we just had a vacuum toilet come through the ninja cameraman absolutely absolutely mopped the floor with that unit you know i might have underrated the strength of the ninja cameraman or it might be because it's medium mode and a legendary unit should mop the floor with medium mode we now have a maxed out team of ninja cameramen this is when my surveillance camera woman was absolutely struggling but look at those toilets just get decimated hey boys not too bad good form Where'd you learn how to throw like that? Not me, I'd break a bone. Oh, come on, this is too easy. Bring on the boss already. Not that boss, the actual boss. All right, we got a couple parasites. We got the boss who at 2.0, who actually only has 200,000 
health points? That seems drastically low. Choo, 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 choo. The boss to a 2.0 is coming through. Are we gonna have any issues doing- No, no issues. Why is it that the boss toilets always seem so underwhelming? And then we have this conga line that essentially has more HP than the boss toilet had? It doesn't really make sense. This video took us all the way from the common unit to the legendary unit. If this video gets a thousand likes, I will do mythic all the way to godly units. I would have fit it all in this video, but I think it ended up would have been too long and you guys wouldn't have liked it as much. Either way, if you haven't already, make sure you guys subscribe. We are trying to get to 100,000 subscribers by the end of the year. And I'll see you guys all again soon. Bye.